Welcome back for another Ash Design training video. Today I'm going to show you how to use the JPEG or PNG file that came along with your Amped Effects template. And we include these files so you can create custom brushes so that you can customize the templates even more. So the, the image I have open right now is some clouds or smoke from the Attitude template. And I'm just going to show you how to make it into a brush and how you can use it to customize the template even more. So the very first thing I'm going to do is go up to this Edit and I'm going to come down and select Define Brush Preset. And when I do that, it's going to let me name it. So I'm going to call this my Attitude Smoke. You can name it whatever you want. And click OK. And then I'm going to go over to my template, and this is the Attitude template, and there's an entire video that shows you how to customize this template. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here to my Layers palette, and you can see that I have clouds in the background and clouds in the foreground, and I just want to create another layer that's going to have clouds on it. So right down here, this square box with the little corner flipped up, that's create a new layer. So I'm just going to click on that to create a new layer. And so now that I have a new layer, I just want to make sure that that's selected so that my new clouds go on that layer. And then I'm going to come over and get my brush. And you can select the brush you want right up here. And if you scroll down to the bottom, you're probably going to find the new brush that you just defined. So in my case, here's my new Attitude Smoke, and it comes up right there. So I'm going to select that brush. And then when I bring it over here, you can change the size of the brush. Um, and you can also change other effects of the brush. So I use the bracket keys. The right bracket key makes my smoke bigger, and the left makes it smaller. And then you can just paint right on your image. And uh, I have the white selected. You'll want the white if you're doing smoke, but you can definitely change the colors depending on your template. Now because I did this on a layer, I can also come and I can move this layer around just like my other layers. So if I wanted it to be more like over the top of them, I can put it right there. Or this is above the foreground layer. If I want it to be more background clouds, I can just put it underneath him right there. So you have a lot of flexibility with these clouds. One of the other things I want to show you really quick, let me go back to my brush tool, is that you can also come to this little brush palette right up here. And this lets you change the angle um, and flip um, the brush the brush around so that some of your clouds have different look than some of the others. And that just helps you have more variation in your template and create more of a unique look. So play around with the different settings in this brush box as well because you can just change the angle of your brush um, and do all sorts of things to just completely customize your template. So we're really excited about these new AMP templates. We think they're going to be a lot of fun. This is the Attitude template. It's great for seniors in sports, and we just can't wait to see what you guys come up with.